Well, good morning, everybody. Here we are on Sunday, April the 8th. Don't know if you can hear the worship in the background, but just it's been, been a wonderful morning of, of worship and of, of praise and just preparation for, for this morning. And uh, the presence of the Lord is, is like oil dripping off the walls here today. It's incredible, and I'm so excited to, to gather to gather in. It's a, it's a joy to say yes. It's just a joy to say yes to the Lord. It really is. And uh, yeah, so we're uh, we're we're reading through, um, starting on Samuel. Uh, Samuel's a, a, an interesting thing. It's uh, Samuel's uh, Samuel is, is uh, at points it's uh, sad, it's tragic, but often uh, there has to be death before there's life, and uh, that's that's what we're seeing. That there's uh, God's doing a new thing. And uh, Samuel's going to usher in a, a new age for, for the Israelites. And, and, uh, with it will come some bad times and some, also some incredible prosperous times. But uh, often when I read through this, I, I emphasize the uh, Eli sons and uh, the failure of Eli as a father and, and, and such. And we see his lack of discernment when, when he thought Hannah was... Um, was drunk when she was just praying. But setting that aside, maybe maybe it's just because of the atmosphere that's in this place today, but I, I, I don't want to I don't want to give our emphasis to the negative here. Um, I, I want to look at what God's doing. I just want to look at what God's doing. What's he doing? Uh, we we know what evil is doing, but but what is what is God doing? And uh, Hannah because because of her pledge um, great favor is shown to her she, she made a promise and and God responded to her and gives her a son and she follows through and you can only imagine how hard it would have been for her to give up her son that way only getting to see him uh, perhaps once a year uh, as they came up for the, the, the yearly sacrifices um, So this favor is shown to her, but even greater favor is shown to her because of her faithfulness of fulfilling the promises. And she had uh, she had more children, and uh, she was blessed. And so we, we find that this song, the song that she sings, it's an incredible song. It's a it's a it's a song of worship. It's um, it's an overwhelming song because she's overwhelmed, and she says, "The Lord, He brings." Just, just listen to it. He brings death and gives life. Takes down to the grave and raises up. Why? Because he's Lord. He's Lord. She's recognizing he's sovereign. He opens the womb. He closes the womb. She's saying here, he brings death. He gives life. He takes down to the grave. He raises up. Why? Because he's the Lord. The Lord. He makes poor. Gives wealth. Brings low. But also lifts up high. God raises the poor from the dust, lifts up the needy from the garbage pile. God sits them with officials, gives them the seat of honor. The pillars of the earth belong to the Lord. He set the world on top of them. God guards the feet of his faithful ones, but the wicked die in darkness, because no one succeeds by strength alone. No one succeeds by strength alone. He is the Lord. That's, that's Hannah's declaration. He is the Lord. Why? Because he did the impossible. He opened her womb. He, he gave her a son and he gave her a family. And um, I, I love her husband in this. Her, her husband does all things right. <laughs> her husband. Why aren't, aren't I worth the, aren't I worth 10 sons? And uh, when she said that she had to fulfill the vow, he, uh, he, he pronounced blessing on her and said, do it quickly. Do it quickly. Uh, there's there's so much here to learn about about worship and our response. She had so much to worship because because God made Himself evident. He showed His goodness. She's she was worshiping Him out of because of His goodness, and uh, surely, surely, because of the cross, because of our salvation, because of all the things that He does for us daily, surely we offer Him even greater worship. So as we gather in today, I have great expectation. Uh, this place is just dripping. I'm telling you, it's dripping. 
So uh, come in, come in, come in, and 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 come with Thanksgiving. Come with the prayer of Hannah. Come with the song of Hannah, and let's let's rejoice in the Lord. See you soon.